decided was the black folk are the most homophobic folk on the planet. And so what we can do is use homophobia and they will join us to fight against themselves. And by the thousands, we have joined against people who are opposed to us and our somebodies. So here's what they did. They would come into the House of Representatives and attach amendments to legislation. You know, maybe we've got a legislation to build a new neutron bomb. And they'll attach to it that we can build a neutron bomb as long as we don't use any illegal gay workers <laughs> who are transvestites. <laughs>
to get them arrested because he supported the hate crime bill. And worse, they said, nobody white can, can represent them because they were represented by Harold Ford. Harold Ford was one of the sponsors of the hate crime bill. And they said it publicly. And these are the same preachers who said, we got to get Harold Ford in as the first black senator. Let me see. <laughs> now, these black people say that a white man can't represent them in Congress, but a black man it should get the votes of the white people in Tennessee. I went to a black school. We had books after the white folks had used them. I went to Prairie View. We didn't have all of the equipment. But I don't have to take logic <laughs> to understand that we're fighting against ourselves. The hate crimes bill is something we've got to support in the church. Now, I, I know, you know, uh, you, you know uh, I, I heard preachers on TV talking to black preachers. They, that's all they use on this one. Uh, talking about how horrible this is. And they have not even read it. No? No? They have not even read it. And it's so sad. It is so sad. Now, let me talk about one other issue, and then I and then we'll go into question and answer. And it, it, it is an issue that I think black folk ought to have at the top of the agenda for the next decade. Polar bears are my friends. I love polar bears. <laughs> I'm an animal. Person, I my family will tell you. I, I, I read books. I can I can talk up here uh, about animals in depth. Uh, whether it's lions uh, uh, or hyenas, which people think for cats and I mean dogs, and they're not the cats. But but I love polar bears. But they'll kill you. Uh, but they are some beautiful animals. There are only thirty five thousand of them. Alive. Why? Polar bears, like most animals, are trained in survival by their mothers. And polar bears, when they're cubs, will ride on their mother's back. Because a polar bear can swim, this is amazing, 50 miles. And so the little cub is trained that at a certain time of the year's instinct, we, some of us in church may call it getting happy, but it, it's instinct. <laughs> and they know that at a certain time of the year, they swim out to a, an area that they can't even see. In church, we call it faith. They, they just they swim out. 